Welcome back with Max. Okay, and this is the gameplay for Hawk. And I'm going to evolve another plane into SS class. So let's get started. And which plane that actually going to have another evolution that is going to be separate right here. And I have more than ready planes to evolve to SS class. As I have mentioned before, I've collected every single card. And here goes. Let's talk about Sapper. We have every feature up or at perks. We got increase in these stats as well. So let's evolve it into SS class all right there you go it's complete and now let's get this into action into the R stage that i have right here let's follow this so the shield will likely to get uh less times for recovering it's like 30 seconds less than the previous one was 45 seconds all right let's destroy the targets and let's see how this sapper will be able to conquer this stage all right that seems to be good enough soloing this heroic stage that's what at least going to be great all right so normal bullet seems to be working quite well i suppose that the stage is heroic so when you can kill the normal bullets normal enemies with normal bullets that means the plane is good enough for you to evolve or for the normal stage use and we have to be we have to see it yet on the boss so that's why right excellent incredible and the shield is on so it's awesome to have shield on every 30 seconds unless you got hit and then the shield is gone so you have to wait for another 30 seconds and that's the overdrive for this plane good enough to clean the entire screen that's what i like clean the entire screens for a few seconds so that's the best part for this plane overdrive remember that all right lasers hitting everywhere and all right let's get this and we have lasers lasers everywhere just going to get that with bill and our laser right here oh my goodness look at the damage that doesn't seem to be oh my goodness that's very hurting my planes and all right so let's have another chance probably with uh delirium i'm not sure but just to avoid the laser is better since i have rare lasers on every stages i have rarely encountered them and all right now let's go with the next we are doing victory on the stage and now how about one two four against doom and let's see if Cyber is good enough against this kind of boss or not. Alright, let's get this. Destroy 68 targets. That's going to be not that much since this is a boss stage. Combination between killing the normal enemies and then the boss. Alright, Lagatus as one of the copy for this Cyber ability. So I, I can have like four slash on the screens after legatus then trying to get hit and it's like all right extra bonus for slashing the enemies and great i got the shield on that's going to make sure that my plane is going to be safe from one hit from the final blow of the any incoming enemies all right there we go the shield is gone just getting hit and now trying to get this bill and all right incoming tanks shooting everywhere all right this plane has to go i don't like the well the circles around it electrify or whatever that killing me very fast boss doom here goes so i'm going to test this plane as a supper against this boss and i have still like a lot of health left so that's the overdrive going to reduce a huge amount of health that's going to be great not killing the boss but that's uh, a reduction in the health that's going to help all right now next is the drone appearance for this drone now I just use this beetle and now just remains the front drone that's going to be a little bit tough for getting this as it shoots lasers and four i mean six rockets six or eight i didn't pay attention to that and now next is this 
getting the main, the last phase for this boss. So I was trying to get hit. Alright, the pincers. That's going to be dangerous, so you have to avoid that. And now let's get this with the overdrive. Perfect. Now that seems to work well between the forward ability and then the overdrive. I think this is one of the planes that goes well with the combo of the overdrives and the forward ability that seems to be working a lot of damage on the boss. Now how about this? 130. I'm so curious. Uh, uh, well, if the sapper could destroy this kind of boss. Well, this boss is kind of tough for certain planes. So I'm going to have sapper this time all right now the normal bullets getting this all right shooting everywhere that's great so that's i got one extra bullets to trigger the fourth ability for this plane hyper wave there you go all right not going to hurt this boss very much but at least the more you try to damage the boss with that fourth ability the more that you are clearing every single bodies for this boss. Look at the health. So it evenly uh, defied the damage. It's like all the screen damage. So it's not going to be that big like a single target hit. And alright. There you go. Cleaning up the body for this boss. It seems good enough. That most of it got damage. And alright. The last one is the overdrive. See what I was talking about, it's about the synchronization between the overdrive and the forward ability. That this plane has the chance to be one of the most useful useful planes, I'm not sure. Useful or the strongest, I'm not sure if that's going to be the strongest, but at least for now laser bite is one of the strongest plane. Well, anyway, I think that this plane is okay, so I'm going to recommend this plane to you guys and of course, uh, you have to upgrade it very often to 140 into maximum SS class and I'm not sure how this plane will perform at maximum level. So anyway, this is all my gameplay for today and thank you so much for watching the video. Don't forget to subscribe, leave thumbs up as always and goodbye. Oh, menace. Throw those napalm. Alright, that's great. Now the recovery rate for menace is fast enough for reloading speed robot. And that's why I have Menace as my backup. And here it goes. It's not really suitable for cleaning up the entire screen. But I think that this is one of the best combo that I could have for now.